<laughs> it's time to get unready. So the first thing I do is tie my hair in a bun because I don't want my hair getting in the way of my face and my skincare. Alright, so the first thing I do is take off my makeup and I use um, this product called Bioderma. I learned about it just through the modeling industry. All the makeup artists use it, all the models use it. I also use these reusable pads. I'm all about eco-friendly and sustainability. So when I found out about these and I learned that you could just put them in the washer and dryer, it's just better for the environment. So just take one. A generous amount. Before, I would usually do micellar water or a makeup remover and then I would use a cleanser. But in my experience, I would always break out when I would use a cleanser. And there was this one time when I got lazy and I just stopped using cleanser and then my skin cleared out. And I was talking to a dermatologist about this and she was like, it's actually healthier for your skin's natural oils to like come out. Because if you use a cleanser every day, it just strips it off of that. So the next step I do, of course, is brush my teeth. And I love this product from Schmitz. It's SLS-free, fluoride-free, you know, artificial flavor. So it's just really good toothpaste. <laughs> my dentist told me that you have to do an up and down motion rather than a sideways motion, so just a little tip if you already didn't know that. So if you can see, I have really dry lips and it happens to me all the time. So I always look for the perfect lip balm. I probably have like 20 lip balms just cause I am obsessed with finding the perfect one and I found it. Image Skincare actually does this and it has SPF 15, which is a great addition. I really don't like doing my skincare with dry lips. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put some on. Okay, so I just took off my makeup now. Um, I don't always put masks on every day, but if I feel like my skin needs some tender loving care, then I will put some. So I use this eye mask from KNC Beauty. It's an all natural retinol infused eye mask. So I use this mask after I put the eye mask. This one is Charlotte Tilbury's Goddess Skin Clay Mask. Whenever I go to facials, they have all these brushes and fancy brushes and I was like, I don't want a brush to put my mask on, but I have all these brushes that I don't use anymore. So I was like, I'll just use one of these because it works perfectly. I feel like I'm having a facial right now. <laughs> I travel a lot and that affects my skin a lot because it gets really dehydrated. So when I feel like my skin needs a lot of love, then I will leave it on for a long time. Now it's coming up. Okay. The mask left my skin very hydrated, but I feel like I can use more hydration, so I'm gonna use my toner. Depending on what my skin needs, I use two different kinds of toner. There's this treatment lotion from La Mer and this oil absorbing tonic from La Mer. So if I feel oily, then I'll use this toner, and if I don't, then I just use the treatment lotion. So right now, I'll use the treatment lotion. I use these two serums depending on what my skin needs. This is a revitalizing hydrating serum from La Mer and this is the Renewal Oil. So if I feel like my skin is very dry, I will use the oil. Other than that, I will use the hydrating serum on a normal day. So today I'm going to use the Renewal Oil and I'm going to use this new tool that I got. It's called Skin Gym. This tool actually relieves tension in your muscles and relaxes them and it helps your skin absorb the products more. I use a an upward motion from my 
chin and nose, it's always going up. Mostly this motion is for lifting the skin and we do not want sagging skin. My next step is my moisturizer and I use this moisturizing cream from La Mer. But what I love doing is using this brush to massage it in. So I use this tool because it just feels really nice. I don't really know if there's a difference if I just use my fingers, but I love it because it's so soft and I just, when I feel like I need some pampering, this is the tool that I always use. The next product that I use is this eye cream from La Mer. So a friend of mine told me that dabbing as opposed to sweeping is better for applying it because it's it's just more gentle so the next step is spot treatment especially if I have acne I'm breaking out a little in my forehead it's very clogged so I would use this acne spot and area treatment from Peter Thomas Roth The last thing that I like to do before going to bed is actually brushing my hair. People always ask me how I have silky and smooth hair and this is the secret. So my mom would tell me to do it, like comb your hair. <laughs> it's just instilled in my head to always brush my hair. So that was my nighttime routine. I hope you guys learned a thing or two and it's time to go to bed because sleep is also great for your skin.